Hey everyone, I'm going to show you how to make cake balls painted with pineapples. First, you can use a Wilton mini ball pan and you just take the two semicircles, put icing in the middle, and then crumb coat it as seen here. Or you can use the other option of how you could traditionally make cake pops, which is crumble up some cake, add icing so it adheres everything together, make a ball, and then crumb coat it. Make sure your crumb coat is pretty thin and that you chill it for a few hours so that the fondant doesn't cause it to melt when you put it over the cake. You then put your fondant over your chilled cake and bring it down so that you have pretty smooth ball and you're gonna go ahead and cut the excess so that you can put it under the cake ball so that you don't see it from the top. I'm cutting the excess with a pizza cutter. An X-Acto knife would probably be easier, but I don't have one right now. And then you can just go ahead and make sure you can get those edges in as smooth as possible. You can use a fondant smoother and do the best you can to keep it round as you're doing this and probably a good idea would be to put cornstarch on your hand so that the cake and the icing doesn't sweat causing the ball to lose its shape. Then you're going to smooth out the top a little more and the bottom. Just play around with it until you get the perfect shape and you know pretty smooth. Now I'm going to paint using Edible Art by Sweet Sticks. She's located in Australia, but she does have distributors in the U.S. So if you check her website, which I include in the comments, you can find those distributors. I'm using yellow and pastel green and green and brown to paint on these pineapples. The great thing about this paint is that it dries very quickly and it doesn't need mixing. So you can just simply paint on as is and you have a really great product. So after I do the pastel green leaves, I'm going to put some regular green on top and then I'm going to paint on the brown and I'm using really thin paint brushes for this so that I have thin lines. Oh, 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 oh,